soccer in the USA. I think so. You know, people always be like, oh, that's pretentious or whatever. You're trying to be something you're not. But I like the sound of football better than soccer. I do. Yeah, football. But yeah, football. Football. All right. Welcome back to another anime reaction. I am YZ. I am Rise. I'm Maya. And today, we're so excited to be watching something that was highly requested. This is first reaction to Lula. 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 We all are brand new to it. We know it's football, soccer based, you know? So first and foremost, what sports did y'all play? I played baseball, third base in particular. We had a hot corner. Shout out to all my baseball players out there. Me. Awesome, awesome, <coughs> Maya. Excuse me. I played football, uh, volleyball, and I did try, and I did a little flag football just to try it out. But football was the main sport I played since I was like three years old. I ran track, I also played soccer, football, and mar did martial arts for most of my uh, young life. But I brought all that to the table because as different athletes, we all have one thing in common is that competitive spirit. We know what it is to win, we know what it is to lose. We like to win, but we also have to learn how to lose. And I'm looking forward to seeing what possibility of a uh, story and uh, lesson we can learn from this show. What'd you guys think? Man, I wanna see what y'all be talking about. Blue it was very highly requested. A lot of people I, was hyping it up, so yeah. I'm excited. Man, my homeboy, he mentioned Blue Lock a couple times. He was like, bro, <laughs> you can watch Blue Lock. Yeah. Yeah, I'm like, Alright. I got that same reaction from the dude I was telling you about. He uh, was wearing a t-shirt and a, uh, he had his phone. Uh, I forgot. I don't know who the character is yet, but that was my final sign. I was like, we gotta watch this. So yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing what this could potentially be, man. Who knows? It might be a new favorite. I'm coming for y'all. I believe in y'all. I believe in y'all recommendations. I'm coming for y'all. <laughs> no, I, I believe in them. Let's see. One thing I will say, the reasons why I like Haikyuu is because it's very realistic. From what I've seen of like Kuroko's basketball, I think, they be looking like niggas be having powers on that shit, bro. <laughs> and then like with Eyeshell 21, it kind of had like a certain fantasy-esque little vibe to it as well. Mm -hmm. I'm wondering if like, if this gonna be like that. <laughs> e even though it's cool, I'm just curious. I I'm not gonna have a problem with it as long as it's executed properly yeah, i can see what you're talking about like it's just too crazy like dragon ball z soccer bro exactly or like this dude got some nine tail like ability <laughs> yeah, no. like, well yeah we gonna get into it uh give it a try <laughs> give it a try this is blue lock episode one blue lock Let's go! Yeah, I'm liking this already. I love this sport. That would irritate them. Oh, bro. That would annoy me to my very core. Especially oh, if I had no. the ball. I had the ball and I felt that I could make that point and I pass it to someone else. Yeah, I couldn't be mad though. Honestly, I couldn't be mad. He was calling for the ball. Yeah, he was. He was calling for it. <laughs> Bro, lit. He <laughs> put his hands through his hair. I got girls, bro. It's so cold out there. Ooh. I gotta say, the animation for this is uh, interesting, though. I like the line work. 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 I like you're the best, best player. player. It looked like he don't like that whole motto right there. Representing Japan. Big honor. Ooh. That yes. That what a feeling. In his mind, he knew he could have taken the shot and made it. Yeah, and they heard, awful one. 
One fall! One fall. All of one. Oh, I said it backwards. Hell. <laughs> yeah, you don't like that. Dang. Dang, bro. That's intense. Hey, I don't eat pork, but that look good. That look crunchy. It does. Good texture. Yeah. <laughs> the dad funny. Damn football, you mean? Really? Yeah, just like the eggs. Hey. Shit, you probably showed out a little bit. Oh, that's bro for the game, huh? Mm-hmm. Amazing passes to me. <laughs> Dang. I don't know, that almost sounded like he was thinking kind of like he better than him or something. Like a backhanded compliment. Mm. Tuning his hands, like, what? Dang, our, some of their yeah. eyes look scary, but... Bro, that is a grown man. Yeah. Damn. Nah, this is like some whole little recruit type shit. Yeah. To make sure they get, like, the lowest players. Mm -hmm. Striker. Yeah. お前は今日からここで共同生活を行い、俺の考えた特殊な特区トレーニングを行わせてもらう。What I don't know. All these people look kind of lit. He looks like, man, shut up. <laughs> watch, watch all these people switch up. He might say how much money you get or something. Mm -hmm. uh, bro, I got a grasshopper body, a uh, mantis body. He's kind of scared. <laughs> Dang, he is not playing with them, bro. Sucker <laughs> energy. Dang, so this is what they taught in Japan. Okay. So it's that the World Cup. You got the facts. Those guys who have never won. Did he say that? Damn. Bruh. I gotta look up and see if they actually said that. <laughs> His ego. He's saying a lot of truth though. Man, this is the opposite of high cube. Right, yeah, that's creepy, dark energy too. It's not about teamwork on this shit, it's about me, you, me. <laughs> no, he's saying facts though. He's talking about this dude's the exact situation. Yeah. That's what they taught in Japan. Like he said, the Japanese thought from it. To be honest, y'all, that's he just speaking straight back. So a striker, Yeesh. He the first one. Yes, what I always thought. 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I thought we had you. I thought we had the same, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I, I knew all of us gonna switch up from something. <laughs> hey. Okay, this is gonna interest I mean, is this a new program? I guess he I think made it, it is. up or something. He just came up with he it. He making it sound like King of Iron Fist. He been doing this. This whole facility together. So he's last. He said two hundred ninety nine people. He looked crazy. Yeah. It's like I saw their eyes. <laughs> They're intense. Why, why the fit so tight? Bro, what? Bro, real for a high school. He is real. I was thinking that. Working hard. You like Connie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's 300, so he's not like. Like, who is he? Mantis man, <laughs> bowl cut guy. <laughs> 299? Last. Dang! Last. Out of 300? I'll be pissed. And then Connie. He's last. <laughs> Ever? No matter how hard they try? From their faces, that's what it looked like. Is that a girl? Yeah, it do look like a girl, bro. You guys gotta throw the ball at each other, kick it at each other? No hands, or kick it at each other. I don't like the way this game sounds. Yeah. <laughs> Connie ain't playing, boy. Where else are you gonna leave? I don't want to go back to the Titan world, but... Oh. Are you trying to go after next lowest ranked person? <laughs> bro, bro, Connie is not playing, bro. Stop calling him Connie. <laughs> he ain't trying to go back to the Titan world. Oh snap, you sleep. Best person to try. Now he's sleeping and he's dreaming. Oh! He was Bro. dreaming about it though. He was dreaming about pass, getting the ball pass. I don't think he was going to try. Damn. Oh, you're right. This man big. Yeah, bro. Fucking rip this shit. Ooh. Oh, damn. Connie got his ass. Yeah. Oh, no, he on it now. <laughs> Ooh, I want to be on his what? bad side. No, he get I'm hit. I body slamming me, bro. Ooh. The wrong place at the wrong time. Bro. Connie is not trying to go back. I mean, you gotta respect it to a certain extent. All about that ego. For real. Yeah, you better try, man. Yeah, I don't know if you can catch Connie. Bro, what? What? Bro. Oh my gosh, he's different. That'll be annoying as heck. He's a little eccentric. Yeah. I like how he's about playing fair. You hurt your leg? He said, wait, <laughs> time out. Hit him. Nah, you gotta get him. For real. Just do it. This is so intense. Yeah, it is. Ooh, why he like moving back like that? That's <laughs> <laughs> kind of weird. He hurt his leg. Oh. Bro, again, power up on his foot. Hell, got to move like that, though, stuff. Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Smack the get fire out of him. What the fuck? You didn't get him? What you doing? Oh. I respect that I know what he's doing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You gotta go for somebody stronger. Going for the weakest person is just gonna make it 299 still. Mm -hmm. He said, I like you. 
Oh, Woo! oh the ball right from you. Damn. Who you got to take At the last 10 seconds. Whoa. Oh, you come to the hill. Woo, he dodged that. Yeah. Damn, hey. bro, trying to fight? <laughs> Where did you, you about to do that? It's like advanced soccer right here. Uh, he just took it from him just to make him do it again. <laughs> I thought that was homies. Oh, damn, bro. Didn't even think about it, bro. Just reacted. He hit that nigga hard, bro. Dang, that was it. That's it. I thought we was going to something next. That was good. Okay, mm. blue block. I'm excited. Hold on, let's. It might be something that day. I'm dancing. Okay. What's coming next? Yeah, we got to do the story, I guess. I just want I mean, to say let, something. Let, let us know if it do, though. That dude, whoever he is, he was speaking straight back. Oh, Jim Pachi? Yeah, it's like, that's the one that, like, you know, the main position I played was striker. You literally have to have that type of mentality. Like, when I think about, like, all the points I ever scored playing soccer, it wasn't, like, me thinking, like, oh, let me, like, make sure I get a pass, you know, pass it off to somebody else. Like, you literally got to have that certain mindset, like, yeah. I'm that person. I can do this. I'm like, I just remember I had a coach that... Uh, he was more into that mindset that they showed at the beginning with the one coach of like passing the ball, having a certain type team cooperation and making through a certain place, which is good, but you gotta have a certain balance. Cause my dad coached me a few years, well coached our teams, and he was more like he had like that mindset, like the one dude we met with the ball. Um, yeah. Tarantula, <laughs> the ball. What, what you call him? Oh, man. 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 He had more of that mindset about a striker, just like more aggressive. More aggressive. So, like, I remember I had certain games with my dad's on the side of the field. He was like, Maya, go! He was like, take it down, him. take it down the field. And my coach would be pissed, and I'll actually make a goal every time. Really? And then my coach would take me out of the game afterwards. What? Because him and my dad had, like, a certain beef, and he didn't like that I would, like, listen to my dad on the field. Like, he was like, I'm your coach, but my dad, take it down the field now. What? And then I'll take it down and make a point. How would that, that feel? That shit felt so good. Like, I know you feel like a rock star hopping off the field. Like, my hey, coach yeah. took me out the game. But I made the point. That's yeah. what I felt. Bro. I was just like so passionate about that part. I was like, you gotta have that ego. You gotta be like, I'm the yeah, one. Yeah, basically bro. saying like, you know, you're here to be a star. Not exactly. Like a, yeah, yeah. I like this show so far. Me too. From yeah. based off the first episode, it has a very interesting approach. It's almost like very competitive, almost like fighting type of anime. But it's yeah, awkward. yeah, it, yeah. It got, and it's the opposite of High Q. High Q got like that whole little wholesome teamwork uh, makes the dream work vibe. <laughs> yeah. But this like. <laughs> <laughs> like, bro, you need to be in your ego. You need to destroy your enemy. And yeah. you get on saying abandon all cooperation that you got in your mind if you're a striker. All mm -hmm. different things. Especially with that position specifically. You has got to keep pushing forward and that the people behind you like got your back and the ball go back. You know, they got yeah. you. You got to have that type of mentality. Nah, that's shit wrong. That's wrong. I, I like this. I'm interested to see how the main character really going to be. Yeah. It seemed like he the main one that could easily possess this hidden ego that he probably like buried deep down and i actually want to talk about the whole japan thoughtfulness type of vibe mm -hmm. just like how in japanese culture it's about being mindful of others and things like that but just knowing the fact well is this a true fact that they haven't wor won a world cup i don't know if it's i don't know if that's true here, but maybe here in this world I'm not yeah sure. in this world okay yeah because i want to know if that really tie into football in their yeah. world if if that's true that's crazy that the own they own moral system is what's holding them back in that sport. That would be crazy. Yeah, it sounds it sounds nice and everything, but it's not conducive to the competitive spirit. Yeah, and it's like, bro, if you playing, you playing to win. So why, like, if y'all not aiming or getting to the World Cup, what's the point? That's and I wonder crazy. if like this show made like an impact on yeah. the society. Or I wonder if they started to uh, change their mindset. Yeah, change their mindset, and that's what played into the show as well of them figuring out like yeah we been like this for too long you feel me i wonder if 
that's the case. I get what you're saying. I'm on uh, Cora. Somebody said Japan has never won the men's football world cup. The women did. I don't know how true that is. Y'all leave in the comments. Let us know. Yeah. Let us know. Because you know, I could be absolutely wrong about um, saying y'all moral system is probably what's holding y'all back in, in this sport. This, in this world, that's what he's saying. Yeah, yeah. that's what he's saying. He bring right. that up. But uh, you know, please don't take offense to anything I'm saying. To you get what I'm saying, y'all. Man, y'all got a great moral system. Being mindful of others, I, I respect that a lot. Yeah, we but, don't see uh, that a lot. If no. that's the case with the sport, though, that. That's interesting. Yeah. I wonder if they already making them changes just because of Blue Dog. No, no. It got me wondering, like, the same thing that happened with Haikyuu, how it influenced all these young men to get into volleyball. I wonder yeah. if Blue Lock influencing the game song. in Japan. Yeah. yeah. That's exactly mm -hmm. what I was but thinking. Some, I think even with Haikyuu, too, if we're doing a parallel comparison, on one side, maybe it works better for people to have a more wholesome view of the sport they're playing. But somebody like myself, I need competitiveness. I want to be the best. In but I'm playing. with volleyball, it kind of has no choice but to be a team sport because you true. could you can only touch the ball once. Mm -hmm. You know, you yourself that's as a player, right? That's true. So it's just like that's it has a more to be. Yeah, yeah, it's a team. And we see Kageyama do with that. Like you can't, you know, you no matter how bad you want to be the ego striker, if you will, you can't. Yeah, yeah. But this, you can touch the ball. Yeah, yeah. versus yeah. soccer. You can yeah, you can hold on to it. I guess I'm more than nobody. Yeah. Sheesh. Yeah, this is a great little episode already just to introduce us to a new show. But yeah, y'all leave it in the comments, man. What you guys think? I'm um, rocking with it. So fun. I'm, I'm rocking rockin with it. I'm rocking with it too. Yeah. yeah. I, I have one more point mm -hmm. I just want to bring up. I wonder if we would see, like, if all that is true and factual, if we'll see a correlation in the countries that won the World Cup the most, like, how their society is, like, mm -hmm. how that influences their team as a whole <laughs> or or how does that influence their strikers yeah. like compare like the data of like how much their strikers make goals that's a really like, profound because honestly question. you know over here in uh it's like i kind of feel like i've seen it the one thing i'll say growing up in over here in north america or the u.s we not as big as the rest of the world on football i don't really know much about soccer or football i should say whatsoever so i have no clue of the world of this sport in general. I don't know who probably won the most World Cup games or anything like that. Yeah, what, so what it's country? Brazil. 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 Which makes a lot of sense, actually. What's the second? Germany. Mm. I can see that too. Germany, Italy, Argentina, France, and then Uruguay. Mm. Man, shout out to y'all, man. Good job. Wow. I wanna, Good job. I wanna give y'all applause. I wanna bring up one more thing. I'm sorry. This I just kind of, I feel like this keep bringing up one more thing. Yeah. But like one thing just from like past experience, I feel like that helped develop that same type of ego you need with that striker position. Was I remember during like not the regular season, I would play like three on three soccer, and when there's only three people on the field on your team, it really like trained you to like rely on your because you only okay. had two other people on the field yeah. you can literally pass the ball to. But I don't know. I'm just thinking about that. Just a random point I wanted to bring up. Yeah, interesting. Not, and not saying that uh, teamwork isn't important in that sport. Teamwork is important yeah. in that sport. You definitely want to make that clear real quick. Because, you know, your people got to trust you in some shape and form. I, I definitely do think that whole ego thing played a big part, though. I feel like especially yeah. with that position as a forward and a striker, yeah. you know, having that type of mindset yeah. goes far. And I'm really looking forward to see uh, how creative the challenges will be with because like mm. tag, you know, like yeah. whoever gets hit with the ball last. I don't know what I forgot that it might be more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just looking forward to seeing what new challenges are gonna come forward to somehow turn somebody into the best striker. Yeah, so yeah I'm, that's interesting. I'm excited about that. But yeah, if you guys like the video, go ahead and like the video. Leave a comment. You know what I'm saying? What I'm gonna say? Oh yeah, subscribe. That's important. Yeah, yeah subscribe. definitely subscribe. And check out our other content if you like this content. On our Patreon. Yeah. On check us out. Yeah. We appreciate y'all. Thank you guys for watching. You guys have a great one wherever you are. Enjoy yourself.